Okay, so I am on my 67th hour of a fast. I have not eaten food for 67 hours. It is currently Friday. <laughs> uh, the last thing I ate was Tuesday dinner. And not only do I not feel bad, I feel uh, incredible energy, incredible clarity. Um, I'm super happy. And right now I have no plans of stopping within the next short term time. So I want to do this video because I talk a lot about fasting. I talk a lot about the power of fasting. I love helping people learn how to fast correctly and easily. Um, I don't often ask people to do this long of a fast uh, by any means, but it's incredible what you can do, what you can accomplish um, health-wise and personally when you tap into fasting. And so I want to talk about that. But first, I want to address the few things that people often say when I talk about fasting. So a lot of times people will ask, are you weak? Do you have brain fog? Are you moody? Um, do I look like any of those things? Definitely not. Uh, a lot of times people will say things like, I could never do that. I have to eat every few hours or I get hypoglycemic. I get low blood sugar. Um, I could never do something like that. It would be too difficult. Uh, I definitely used to be someone who needed to eat every two hours. I wish I had my sister-in-law along with me. Um, right now she used to laugh at like the amount of snacks I had to pack in my purse um, for an airplane trip anything like that, I, I needed to eat every two hours or I would get hangry, like hungry, angry. So if I can do this, literally anyone can. One of my favorite things to do right now is take people who say things like this and teach them how to fast. Um, it's incredible. It's something I want everybody to know how to tap into. So I'm going to talk about why these things don't happen when you learn how to fast correctly. That's what's really important. If you're someone who eats every two hours and you jump into say like a 14, 16 hour fast, you're gonna feel awful, you're never gonna to wanna to do it again. When you train for it, uh, it becomes incredibly easy. So, can you see this, Jay? Yeah. On the camera, okay. So basically we have two uh, gas tanks in our body, we can think of it like that. We have a glucose tank and we have a ketone tank. So most of us use the glucose tank. We eat food, we fill the glucose tank, so we have energy. Couple hours go by, our blood sugar levels go down, we feel awful, we feel hypoglycemic, we have to eat again. So this tank that gives us energy is very food dependent. You wake up, you eat a bowl of healthy frosted mini wheat cereal or something like that. A couple hours later, you're starving and you have to eat or you feel mentally tanked. The ketone fuel tank that we all have usually sits pretty empty. We have to fill this tank and deplete this one in order to tap into it. So in our program, what we do is we guide people through a healthy way to deplete your glucose tank by lowering your carbs in a healthy manner. So we have to be really careful with how we do it so that people feel good while we load this tank up with good, healthy fats. So we, we teach a virtual six, seven week program at this point. Um, week one, we basically switch you over into the ketone tank. We teach you exactly how to do that. Um, when you fill your ketone tank and when you teach your body to become fat adapted by um, lowering your glucose, filling the ketone tank, you literally tap into that tank when you have no glucose. What's really cool about that is that you're not only not dependent on food for energy, you actually, when you fast and you deplete the glucose tank, you tap into the ketone tank the ketone is such cleaner fuel that if you compare molecule to molecule of say glucose to ketone, the amount of energy you feel from the ketone one is something like 20 times as much. And that's what I feel. So I actually now, and most people will do this as they get really good at fasting and really used to fasting, I will do a 24 hour fast once a week and I choose to do it in my busiest day in the office. This is how I feel, right? So what's really neat too is that you know, a lot of people know we only use part of our brain. So there's a ton of our brain that we don't tap into. When you are using ketones, um, and when you're using ketosis as a nutritional strategy, not that you stay in it, because it's important to bounce in and bounce out, you definitely use way more of your brain and you feel that. So your energy goes through the roof, your mental clarity goes through the roof, um, happiness goes through the roof, you're literally changing your neurochemistry. So a lot of questions I get then are, 
uh, how often do I fast or why would I do a long fast like this? I do a long fast like this every season. Uh, Jason and I do it. We shoot for anywhere up to about five days. And if we fall short and our body tells us it's time to be done, it's time to be done, uh, we drop out. Um, during our fasts, we have water and I actually will have a little bit of coffee in the morning um, during my fasting time as well. Sometimes people have broth, we haven't done that yet, um, but that's it, no food, nothing else. The reason we originally got into this is uh, about four years ago, we were starting to hear the research on fasting and ketones, um, particularly for people that had cancer, or autoimmune conditions. And so we wanted to bring it to our, our client base we will never ask our patients to do something that we don't. And so we literally started experimenting on ourselves. Uh, we loved this way of eating and this lifestyle so much and the benefits that it brought to us that we just, we never stopped. So four years later, we're still doing it. Um, I also have found that fasting is um, super effective for Lyme disease. I have a neurological form of Lyme. My co-infections are meningitis and encephalitis. So. When I had active Lyme, uh, my brain was destroyed, which was really scary to me. And I really don't have many relapses anymore at this point. Anytime I feel anything coming on, I fast and it clears out. So that's really cool. Uh, it's definitely improved our health in many ways. And it, it has the biggest thing for me, I think, is the energy that I have uh, matches the demands that we have in our life right now. So we have three young kids. We run a busy office. We just opened another one in Pennsylvania. We're traveling twice a month to speak on hyperbaric oxygen and ketosis and fasting. And so I really feel that I have limitless amounts of energy while staying a really healthy version of myself. So I do this video because I want people to know that fasting is an incredible tool. Uh, it's something we're genetically designed to do. Anybody can do it if you do it right. Again, like I said, we teach people how to do it. I'm not asking for anyone to join our program. If you want to, we're here for you, of course, but please uh, find someone to work with and help you, even if it's not us, because you want to do it the right way, but tap into this, this system, this program. If it doesn't work for you, then stop. But I want everyone to have access to this incredible healing, energy, nutritional strategy. I will see y'all soon. Let me know if you have any questions.